The other pillar of your social investment program is health, which touches the lives of majority of Kenyans across all counties. This is particularly thoughtful of you, considering the challenges we experience in delivering quality and affordable health care. I urge you to partner with the Ministry of Health, particularly at this time when they are transitioning into a more robust and transformative healthcare financing system for all Kenyans. Your collaboration, especially through strategic health finance models, health technology and innovation, will make an important contribution and impact to Kenyans at the bottom of the pyramid, including those from the marginalized communities. I note you have a pillar on humanitarian relief through which you will provide targeted support to vulnerable and undeserved, underserved, underserved communities, including women, youth, and people living with disabilities. This is perfectly aligned with the government's policy of equity and inclusivity to ensure that every Kenyan, regardless of their background, has the opportunity to contribute and to benefit from our nation's economic growth. Our mantra is that no one should be left behind in our social and economic transformation journey. The last pillar of your engagement is on resource management, which gives you an opportunity to join the global initiative of addressing critical climate change and resilience issues. Your choice of Karura Forest for this important event reaffirms your commitment to support Kenya in managing the impact of climate-related shocks, including frequent drought and severe flooding. Your efforts will no doubt make a difference in our agenda for green growth. I presume you will take this opportunity to identify critical areas of collaboration, including supporting the government to scale up the ongoing tree planting agenda. This will enable us to achieve the target of planting 15 billion trees even before 2032.